Answer me this though, Shadi. After you done been on a road touring the world and everything slows down and you come back to regular civilian life, what was that transition like for you saying, you know what, I'm gonna put the mic down and you know, figure some things out around here? Oh, it was a beautiful thing, see, yeah. because one thing I always did, I kept it real. Yeah. See, I never went Hollywood. Yeah. When I got the money from Luke, I didn't move out to Alpharetta. Yeah, you know what man. I'm saying? I, I stayed in the hood, bro. Yeah. And see, that's what a lot of brothers don't do, man. They get that money. They stay downtown. They scared to come back to College Park, yeah. Glenwood. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? See, you can ask any of these guys in the street, bro. I mm. kept it real. They'll tell you. I'm, I'm going to see Shadi at the wildest spots. Right. Well, you know right. what I'm saying? So it wasn't where I had to... Like change, like oh, I gotta. Yeah. I'm back in the hood now. Nah, nah, I, I always been in the hood. Exactly, yeah, you that's know what and I'm that's saying? true too. Yeah, because I, when I used to be in Nellingwood, you know what I'm saying. Um, after I had them fail a little bit, they, people used to be like, man, you just go around there to Shadi, man. He right there at the club, man. Yeah. He'll spin the new record that you got. That's you know what right. I'm saying? So so it was it was known that you, you know you were accessible, you know, in the hood, and you always have stayed in the hood. People have always been like, you know what I'm saying. You can reach Shadi. You can touch Shadi. He's That's a right. guy that isn't too big headed. Like a lot of these artists that you can't, you can't. Yeah, yeah. You know, you would never like that. And yeah. everybody, everybody appreciates that from him. Oh yeah, definitely, man. I'm, I'm gonna be a hood nigga for life, man. You know what I'm saying? I got a question for both of y'all, though, man. You know, uh, they say fame is a drug. When the fame slows down, do you, you know, want your fame back, or do you even care? I'm going to let you answer that first. Well, uh, it all depends on the money you made. Uh, I think that most <laughs> artists, it ain't, I, I, don't, I, I, don't, I think that most artists, if, if they got the money that they wanted, they don't really care about the fame as much after they have gotten it. Mm -hmm. You can have a little bit, you can be, you know, recognized a little bit, but as long as your, your bag was straight and you felt like you got everything out of the game, you you can live with that. Okay. What you can't live with is the reverse. Being famous <laughs> as hell and you walk around with your I know I know plenty of artists and I'm not gonna call their names. You know I got a lot of friends. That's I know right. somebody that went multi platinum. Yeah. And I'm talking about singing groups. That's right. That's from Decatur. And yeah. I'm talking about rappers. Yeah. And there was much bigger name than my name my or Shadi name. That's right. yeah. And we made more money than them. Damn. So, so those right. are the those are the you know the artists you'd be like you know I, I said damn man you know I felt like I had got beat but I'm glad I didn't sell six million records and goddamn and, <laughs> and, and my money was, and my money funny and you and everywhere you go I don't been around a certain artist and and everywhere we go they're like yo 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 and I'm like I'm in the back ain't nobody fucking with me I'm like <laughs> woo. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So uh, with me, it is you know fuck the fame. Yeah. Uh, when you first set out, of course you do. Ain't nobody gonna sit here and say that when you first looking in the mirror as a, a rapper that you ain't say, man, I'm gonna kill him when I hit the stage. I'm gonna be fresh. They gonna you know. But once you get past that, it's strictly about the you know about the money. You can live with you know fuck some fame. Yeah. Now yeah, can you buy yeah. the house and pay the rent? That's that's the key word right there. So that's that was real important to me. Like. I had to make sure that money was straight, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Cause like, you know, the little bit of money I got out there and made, you know, I was able to pay my mom and dad house off. You know what I'm saying? I was able to go get me a little condo, pay cash for that. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So like he said, it's about the money. You know what I'm saying? The fame thing, you know, I never was with the fame thing. That's why I made that joint call, I'm not a star. You right, know what I'm, I'm not a star. Yeah. 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 You know, he, don't know, he don't even know what that is. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying, he don't even okay. know what that is. Okay, okay. Yeah, he don't know what that is. Yeah, yeah, because <laughs> let me let me tell you what happened. <laughs> What I what, when I was a little guy, you know, we all was little once upon a time, and I used to look up the big rap groups in New York. I'm not gonna call no names, mm -hmm. like you said. And when they started making records and traveling, I remember them from the projects and you know different projects. And I go up to them. They came down here. A couple of groups came down here from New York. I run up, yo, can I get an autograph? And they looking at me like, man, if you don't get the fuck out of my face. Mm. Right. So that used to hurt me. So I used yeah. to say to myself, if I ever become somebody. Great, yeah. right. I would never do my fans like that. You exactly. know what I'm saying? So, right. yeah. Exactly. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's real. Did you ever have to deal with when you, you know, keeping it hood, folks saying, no, nah, you a rapper. I don't want to hear you try to keep it hood because I'm going to try to put you in the rap box while you try to live your regular life. Yeah, and you know, I had problems like that in the yeah. street. Don't get me wrong because 
Niggas was looking at me like I'm a rapper, but they just don't know I'm a street nigga over here now. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. You know, but the streets know. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I mean, I did my damage out there mm -hmm. in them streets. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I mean, it's so crazy because you're going to get tested. You right. know what I'm saying? You know, and then I was making the happy music and shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I was making the dance stuff. Yeah. I wasn't talking about killing nobody or beating nobody up on the mm -hmm. record. So when these guys see me in the street, I guess they think I'm the, the happy man. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, right. you know, that's just the way the streets is. You know what I'm saying? It's do or die out here. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah.